Hi, I'm Jordan Hansen, and I'm from Cobalt Intelligence. Today, we're talking about the Secretary of State of New York. We're going to go to that Secretary of State, and we're going to show how to do a business search there. And then we're also going to go and show how to get that data via API. That's with our portal, and then with Postman, and then with our JavaScript SDK. All right, I don't know if you like New York, but we're going there. Let's do it. All right, New York has pretty good API. It has officer information. Pretty much it only reveals the CEO, if I remember correctly. No organization documents that we can get. Let's go over and check it out at the New York site. You can do all these different things. This looks like a placeholder, but it's not. Yeah, this is a placeholder. It looks like one of these, a drop down, but it's not. It's a placeholder. All right, so come over here and we're going to search for pizza and we're going to start typing in. We're going to search all of those and then we go bam. There, we got our list here. And then we can't, oh, we can't see active from here. I'm going to go, oh, they all have ampersands? Hmm. I want one that doesn't have ampersands. Look at this. Sorted by that or something? Okay. There we go. I'll take this one. Batvia. Pizza 151 of Batvia. You can see over here we have Chief Executive Officer, the CEO. That's what we have here. That's, and then there's the agent. So, Office information, now if we look over here at filing history, we have these things, but you can't click them. You can't look at them. So you can see they're there, but you can't order the document information. All right, now this is our portal right here. This is the Cobalt Intelligence Portal, New York. New York's a pretty fast state. This is a place where you can come and test the data, make sure it all matches what you expect. So we'll search here. There we go. See how fast that is? New York's a quick one. There's our officer right there. Batvia. Now, two postmen. There, like that. There we go. We update this over here. So, typically, you want to encode. I don't know why I have this in here. Well, I copied it. I know why. But in your code, you want to encode the UR or the business name just in case it has an ampersand, as we saw. If you have an ampersand in your query parameter, then, well, it breaks because it thinks it's another query parameter. You're going to want to pass your API key here in the header x API key and the API key. And as you can see, there's all the data right there. So now we go over to our SDK. Right there, we're gonna update this. New York is a breeze. Real nice compared to some of these other ones. All right, this is the JavaScript SDK. If you're using Node.js, you come over here, you import SOS API, then you pass in the API key. You add things like business name, like the state. You add things like screenshot and the different, the street, city, zip, all of these things as well. And there's the results right there. So that is New York with, using, oh, we also have a screenshot here. Like I said, let's look at it. Right there. There's a screenshot for us. It kind of shows that all that information there. You can kind of use this to prove in your due diligence that you've been to this location and you proved that this business is a legitimate business and it is who they say they are. So that's it. That's it for New York. We did pretty well there. Pretty easy to get that information there. If you like this video, if it's helpful at all, subscribe, like it, and we'll talk more later.